<laughs> Love this shield. Oh gosh. Oh man, that guy did not even move. Oh boy. Holy cow. Woo! Ooh, that guy was fast. It's glowing silverfish now, and they're all popping out behind me. Hey guys and gals, Polly Jr. here. Welcome back to Minecraft Vex Super Hostile Isolation Map. We're back at the main base in Talia's bedroom. Just warming up my buns here by the Bun Warmer 9000. <laughs> That's the geothermal plant down there. And, uh, oh yeah, that feels so good. Okay, nice hot crossed buns. Actually, wait a minute. They're not crossed, are they? I don't want crossed buns. I just want hot buns. We'll save the crossing of the buns for later when we need some good luck. <laughs> anyway, we're about to invade Talia's privacy yet again and read her next diary entry. This is day 19. Um, we had just completed in the last episode the central station. We had exterminated very many nests of nasty spiders. And now we're moving on to the uh, biggest dingus mine, right? Biggest dingus load mine. And um, Talia did write about it. It's actually 12 pages long. And I'll come clean. I actually went through this to look for clues as to what we're going to be up against so we could prepare for it. But unfortunately, there's very little in here. Um, that that mentions anything we can use to our advantage So I'm just gonna go through this page by page and you guys can pause the video if you like and read this It's really just color text um, She talks about the mine the mining operation the mining methods and then she goes off on a tangent about villagers and how creepy they are and Yeah, that's about it. So unfortunately, it seems like we're on our own and we can come up with our own theories as to what we're going to run into in the next section, the biggest dingus mine. And I do have a theory, and I'll explain it to you right now. Vex has been getting us prepared for the next section. He does that, right? So if you do it in sequence anyway, he will prepare you for what's coming next by providing you with certain um, items and tools and weapons and so forth to use to your advantage against uh, what's upcoming and in this case we have a lot of blast protection books so I'm thinking we're gonna run into creepers cobwebs too can be used to uh, to slow down creepers and we got that in the central station right so that's my guess and I'm sticking to it by the way I did go back to the uh, the mine in the sinkhole and the the flooded mine and I grabbed 11 more diamonds and I did repair up my uh, blast protection helmet because that does have blast protection for. Sadly, we cannot put any more blast protection on anything else because they already have a particular type of protection and they are mutually exclusive. You cannot combine them. But I think blast protection for on the helmet should be perfectly fine. Uh, we do have our shield here and we're going to use those cobwebs and uh, anything else at our disposal to defeat the enemy and get our box of parts and then build up that um, our airship. Now, there is one more thing I want to do before we go. I have this last book here. It is Knockback. And I want to put that on our sword. So that's going to cost 8 levels. We've got 10 left. But Knockback is going to help us keep those uh, creepers at bay. And I'm thinking maybe... Can we repair... Let's grab those diamonds. I think I want to repair my pants. Take off your pants there, buddy. Close your eyes, everyone. My hot cross buns are off. Oh, no. Okay, we do not have enough experience to fix up my pants, so we'll just hold off, I guess. <laughs> Maybe we should bring a uh, an anvil with us so we can do it on the road. We're probably going to get a couple of levels pretty quick, right? Yeah, I could do that. Yeah, we'll do that. And I think I have a ton of these at the forward operating base, so I'll grab one when we head over in that direction. Um, unless I have some here, do I? No, I don't think so. Yeah, we'll, we'll grab them on the way to the uh, the biggest dingus mine. So, yeah, I will meet you guys there. It's a bit of a hike. All right, you spy chickens. If you want to earn your freedom, then you got to eat up and make it a baby. Come on. Make me some baby chickens. Hey, you, right there. Make me a baby. <laughs> I need the experience. All right, did I miss any? Hold on. This is actually kind of hard in that mode. There we go. Gotcha. Anybody else? We're getting close. Come on. One more baby. You, make me a baby. We got it. Yay, four experience. Okay, enough. Back off. Back up. Back it up. Back it up. Let me out of here. <laughs> All right, so now we can fix up our pants. Let me put those seeds away. The eggs is away. Uh, where's my anvil? Oh, I got an anvil right here, of course. All right, let's um, well, take off them pants. 
and fix them up. Four. Like brand new. Check them out. All right, awesome. Now, now I think we're ready to rock and roll. Got everything we need. Got one more little boost from old Billy. And off we go to the biggest dingus mine, which is right across the way here. Wait a second. <laughs> I just want to make sure I slept here at the forward operating base. Create the spawn. There we go. Okay. That is critical. Just in case we do get blowed up. And we don't have to go all the way back to the, uh, to the main base. We can start right here again. Very, very good. Okay. Wow. Looks like a huge cavern. Oh, look at that. There's a hole in the ceiling so we can see by day, but but it's snowing. It's always snowing here in the isolation map, isn't it? <laughs> Great. So that is going to hamper our visibility, which ain't fun. Um, dang it. Well, let's get out of the snow first and have a look around. This place is enormous. So it looks like there's multiple levels to the mine. Can we go down? Um, no. Well, I mean, we can, but there's nothing down there. Other than water. And that water leads to that other mine, by the way. The flooded mine. So we just have to worry about going up. Oh, what the heck is that? Something glowing up there. Is that? Oh, it sure. Is that a creeper? I told you. It's a glowing creeper. And he's doing the two-step. Uh oh, whoa. Is he coming over this way? He couldn't possibly see us from there, can he? He seems to be moving really fast. He's agitated about something. <laughs> he's got happy feet. Is he burning? I don't know. All right, we're going to eat. I know I don't have to eat right now, but I do not have to, I don't want to have to worry about eating when we're on the run. All right. That's weird. So he's glowing big time, huh? Vex, what did you do to the creepers here? I don't like this at all. I don't like this at all. It's already starting out somewhat odd. All right. Well, at least we know what we're up against. We are up against creepers. So we're going to be on, on the lookout for creeper spawners. Oh, oh, he is just, there's holes in the ceiling here, too. Holy cow. All right, let's find, uh, <laughs> let's find those, those spawners if possible. Oh, you know what I forgot? Dang it, I wanted to take another, uh, I wanted to bring a speed potion, another one. I've got one with me. What is he jumping on? He's jumping on the bed. You know how your parents feel about that. He's sizzling, too, which is really odd. Um, yeah, I wanted to bring a couple more potions of speed. Oh, here we go. There's a bunch of uh, ores here. So if we can outrun these guys, then great. Oh, look at all the holes. We got ores. This is really, really cool. But we're not after the ores. We don't really care much about the ores. Got some glowstone here. What we care about is the box of parts, of course. And spawners, if we can find them. All right, here's another stairwell up. My guess is we're going to have to go up, 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 up. Higher is usually where we need to go, right? So let's move up. I'm going to try to use my bow here as much as possible. If I can. But the problem with the bow... <laughs> is you can't use the shield and the bow at the same time. I mean, the bow is the bow and the shield are up at the same time, but you can't put the shield up to block explosions. So we're gonna have to do a fast switcherisky. Oh man, I don't like all these holes. Oh, here we go, first creeper. Now, knowing Vex, he's probably done something crazy to these. Oh, he has. Look how fast that little stinker is. Okay, one shot looks like it does the deal. Second shot went right past. Um, not sure what the spawners are going to be hidden behind. Probably some wacky block, like he did with the, uh, like he did with the um, the um, the zombies in the in the uh, miner section. My God, I can't even talk today. I don't know if I told you. But I do have a cold right now. My head is in a fog. What is this? Aha! Oh, <laughs> Put it behind a creeper <laughs> block. That was cool. Yeah, my head's in kind of a fog here. I've got a head cold. And um, somewhat of a sore throat. My throat's a little 
raw. I gotta remember that there's holes in the ceiling here. We are not safe anywhere. We could have a creeper fall right on top of our heads. And we wouldn't even know it. So you gotta have 360 degrees here. On a swivel. Up and down included. So I guess we could just go up right here, right? I don't know if it's worth going all the way around the edges. Um, let's dig in. Let's dig into some ice here and make a little base. Just a place to fall back to and hide out if we need to. You know what I mean? Alright, dig in. Something small. I haven't even checked my temperature. I have no idea what it's like. Ah, okay. I can finally rest. Seriously. <laughs> I was holding my breath the whole time. I'm so tense. I don't have a bed or anything. Um, I guess we can put down... Let's put down the crafting bench and all that right here. Put the glowstone in. The warm up right here. Let's check the temps. That's not bad. I mean, our armor right now is so good that... Oh, someone's creeping around out there. Yeah, our, our armor is so good right now. We don't really have to worry about the uh, the temps anymore. It's not really much of an issue. I should have brought a bed and put it in here, honestly. Just in the event that we do happen to croak here. We won't have to go all the way back to the... Uh, even the forward operating base now seems far away, doesn't it? All right. Um, I think we need more torches here. We're going through them fast. Hopefully we have enough wood. All right, let's strategize. I don't think we're going to need the snow master here. Doesn't look like there's any snow to dig through. So I'm going to put the cobwebs down here and the granite in the hands. I think the snow master will just chuck away. I don't think we're going to need it, to be perfectly honest. So let's put it away there. We do have that speed pot. Thinking about popping that right now. Jump boost, regen. Um, it gives us eight minutes. Okay, let's do that. And we'll make a run for it. I really wish I had brought another one with us. I don't think the axe is going to come into too handy here, but just in case. I hear somebody moving around out here. You know what we're going to do? Let's make one more door. <laughs> Actually, three more doors, right? So we can make another operate forward, another FOB somewhere. Now, Vex has made these creepers a little faster. I don't know what else he's done to them. But they're on some kind of performance-enhancing drugs. Speed number one. We've seen the glowy guys. Um, we need to find some stairs. Oh, there's a fella going to the hidey hole. We're here, pal. Oh, my gosh. He sees us from a mile away. All right, good. So they burn out. They sizzle. They fizzle. They fizzle and sizzle. Ah, wow. They are fast. Whoa, we'll fall off the edge. Oh my gosh. All right. You know what? Just shoot him. Just shoot him twice, whatever. Holy cow. Whew. All right. Uh, we got to take advantage of the speed potion while we can. There's a stair over here. Oh, there's a, there's a spawner right here. All right, I got you. I got you. They, have, they seem to have like super duper detection range, don't they? Oh, hi. Ooh. Ooh, ho, ho. That was close. All right, let's get in here and get this quick, 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 quick. Boom, done. <laughs> this is so tense. Oh, I don't like these holes either. Vex. All right. Um, Where's the stair? Oh. They're at the redstone. Yeah, see the glowstone? Glowstone, redstone. That's what we gotta do. We gotta get over there. So it's on the other side. I gotcha. So Vex has given us a bit of a clue here on how to get up. So we gotta find the glowstone. Not really looking for spawners right now. Okay, that goes down. I mean, if we happen to see one. Oh, that guy just spawned right there. Or he fell from above. I can't really tell. Man, you gotta look behind you. These guys are so quick. And it seems like he's increased their, um, their aggro range. Could be wrong about that, but that's my perception. 
lot of ores here if we ever want to come back for ores, but I, I'm not sure it's really going to be worth it. I'm not even going to dig in. I'm just going to do this. Make a quick base. Oh, someone's coming. Um, hopefully there's no holes above our head here. <laughs> All right, let's make a few more torches. We're running through these torches pretty quickly. All right, we've got five minutes left. Oh, there's one of them glowy dudes. Five minutes left of the speed. So let's uh, let's go. Let's take advantage of that. Nobody out. I'm gonna go up right here. Uppity 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 up. Fortunately, I brought plenty of arrows. Oh gosh, is he down here? I can't tell. Oh yes, he is. He just wasted him. I couldn't tell if he was on another side of a wall or what. Now, what is? He, what did he do? Did he drop anything special? No, not really. Ah! Oh. oh, that's a silverfish. Oh, are you kidding? Wah! Oh gosh. I thought I heard a silverfish. No, I know I heard a silverfish. What did you do, Vex? All right, here's another um, way up. I don't see any more spawners here. Uh, I don't like those glowy guys. I have a feeling they're super magical. I don't know what he did, what he did with them, but I don't want to get too close. Okay, more stairs over here. It's kind of a wasted torch. Ah! Okay, I see a spawner. We should probably go get it. <laughs> Love this shield. Oh, gosh. Oh, man. That guy did not even move. That guy did not budge. Did he? I mean, I blasted his face. Oh, what the heck is going on with this guy? Stop bouncing. Oh, I can't hit him. Is he? There we go. I hear silverfish, but I don't see them. All right, we gotta go get this right here. We gotta get it quick. Something's burning. Oh, jeez. Oh, yeah, use this. Let's see if that helps. <laughs> yes, it does. Thanks, Vex. That was great. Okay, now I just have to stay away from them. Uh, what is this over here? Ah, oh, there's another one. They walk right into these things, which is fantastic. Uh, watch out for that, buddy. And another one. And you're gonna burn, right? Oh, maybe not. Okay, this is what we're gonna do. Gonna leave me a little place here. Okay. Take a breather. Two minutes left of speed. We gotta get to that spawner right there. It looks like there's a spawner or something there. Alright. I just don't want to get stuck in this thing myself. And there's the, uh... Stairs up. All right, let's go. Oh, no, 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 no. Run back. Man, these guys do not budge, do they? Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. Right over his head. Get him. Man, it's so dark here. I can't see. Wow, there's no lights here. Oh, it's a cloud. Oh, what the? What was that? That was something invisible. Caller of the who? Oh, gosh. All right, fall back. Fall back. Do not shoot that silverfish. I have a feeling there's more around. Okay, that time that worked, but I don't know why it didn't work the first time, that knockback. Guy was, like, invincible. All right, so I was in a cloud. That's why I couldn't see over there. Don't like that at all. Holy cow. I think there's a spawner here, though. Something over here. Oh, no! Invisibles! That's insane! What the heck, Hex? Hex, Hex Vex? What are you doing? He <laughs> made him invisible. Alright, let's make a little base here. <sighs> I'm gonna dig in. Get safe. Take a breather. Wipe my hands off because they're sweaty. <sighs> oh my gosh. This is insane. How's the temps? Temps aren't bad. Negative 20. We can survive. 
Running them really low on the wood, though. Torches don't even help when you're in the dang clouds. So I could turn off the clouds, and then we'll be able to see better. But I feel like that's kind of an exploit. I mean, this is the fun path, right? We like the fun path. We're gonna do this. Uh, we're gonna do this all natural and legit. So I see glowstone there, but that's where we came from. I think we need to turn to the left here, right? Oh gosh! Ugh. Scared the heck out of me. Is he stuck? He doesn't even see us. Can you get over here, pal? Get stuck in my webs. I can just take care of you. I hate using my bow. Oh, no. I'm on the ice. I can't move. Wow. All right. That's not cool. <laughs> I couldn't move on the ice. I couldn't back up fast enough. Doesn't matter. We survive, and that's the important thing. The shield's okay. All the armor looks okay. Let's go. I probably should have done some kind of a night vision potion too yeah next time remember the dang potions remind me gotta bring the potions ah oh from behind fell down from above man these guys are spooky all right there's a hole here uh not a good hole <laughs> stay away from that hole bad hole we should just go up but i'm curious to see if there's any more spawners we can nail right quick So, apparently there are invisible... Ah! Creepers. And that just ain't right. That just ain't right. Aha! Spawner. Alright, that's good. Alright. Very, very good. How much higher do we have to go? <laughs> On this level, you don't want to stop moving. I mean, you just got to keep moving. If you stand still, creepers are going to find you. They have super large aggro radius, and they're fast. Uh, so you don't want to stop. You gotta keep moving and keep eating and watch your footing too. You don't want to fall through a hole. This is insanity. This guy want to shoot. Oh shoot! Shoot him! Hello? Go! Did I get that guy? Oh, my gosh. Oh, he deked me. Huh, pick up my bow. Just toss my bow down. <laughs> I gotta move that toss key. Oh, hi. Ambush. Sniped. Grab that arrow. Probably should have fixed up my bow before we came down here, actually. Oh, my gosh, another one. All right, that's the way to do it. One shot. Ah! Who is that? Invisible! All right, we got a silverfish knocking on our shield here. I mean, I feel so slow now. Ay, ay, ay. If I don't kill those silverfish today... Ow! Oh, dang it. What is that? Something here. This kind of looks like a face from an angle. Oh, I don't think so. <laughs> I think their face is gone now, buddy. Whatever it was, it's gone now. Yeah, take those silverfish out, would you? Whoa! Whoa! Getting blowed up left and right. Take that. Take that, you little stinkers. Oh no, no, how did you get through? Oh, he path found all the way around, huh? Oh boy, this is bad. We are standing on like the last block here. How did that guy get, a get around? I have no idea. Can't jump, can they? Did Vex make these guys jumpy? That's insane. Oh no, I don't want an apple. Just eat the bread. Okay. Uh, where to next? <laughs> oh, there's a spawner over there, so that's where we're gonna head. Um, this is, looks like a spawner right here too. I'm gonna shoot this guy. Maybe that guy just got through the uh, webbing. I mean, I guess they. I mean, they do get through eventually, right? Uh, that's probably what happened. Oh, 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 oh. Don't stand still, don't stand still. Somebody come up behind. And this is a tall one. Oh, you punk. I knew it. 
And there's another one right here. Can I reach that thing? Yeah, okay. Ow! Oh, I saw that, you little jerk. And here comes more. Oh, boy. No! Ooh, wow, he exploded with one, one hit. That was super fast explosion. All right, let's slow them down a little bit. Oh my gosh, there's a gazillion feet behind me. Let's get to the uh, FOB. There was one over here, right? I need to take a break. Wait, was there one in this level? Maybe I didn't even make one on this level. A little hidey hole? Oh man, I don't like the snow. Can't see in the snow. I don't think I made a hidey hole here. All right, well, this is good. We're out of the snow here. That's good. We can see. Oh, we're being chased. Thought I heard some feats. I don't want to dig into the stone because I'm worried about the silverfish. So if we make a forward operating base. Uh, oh, boy. Holy cow. Woo. Ooh, that guy was fast. What is that thing? It's glowing silverfish now, and they're all popping out behind me. Oh, I don't like that. That dude was fast, but I think that's where we gotta go. That glowstone right there. Um, but I need a little base here. Let's put a base right here. In fact, we're gonna block this off. Alright, there's our target right there. That glowstone, there's a uh, spawner next to it. And I'm assuming there is a stair over there somewhere. I don't know. I hope so. All right, let's go do it. Gotta run for it. Got no more speed boost. I do have a. Uh, I've got a bunny boost, but I don't know how much that's gonna help us, to be honest. Silverfish are still running around. Okay, there's the spawner. Let's go grab that right quick. Quickly now. Quickly. 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 Got it. All right. Now, we got this far. Oh, here's another spawner. No, 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 no. Oh, what was that? Oh, hi. Get in a hole. Get in a hole. He did not go in a hole. You don't listen right. Oh, I missed that spawner. Oh, I hit the block and not the spawner. Get it. Okay, there we go. Some kind of a face here. Yeah, okay, I see the eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Looks good. Oh. Oh. Oh, no, you don't. Okay, we are back on the run again, and it looks like we just went around in a circle. I do not want to kill this guy. But I don't know how to get rid of him. Maybe if I can kill him with one shot, should be good. Okay, good. Got him with one shot. You got to kill him with a single uh, hit. So they can't cry out to the little buddies. Now, I did not see a stairway up. Did you guys? That's not cool. Let's go check again. Missing something. it has got to be a stair up somewhere. Oh, there's the thing right down there. I see the, uh, the brick. It's right down beneath us. So we don't have to go up anymore. We just have to go over. Um... Okay, well, we'll light this whole area up here. So we gotta get down there. Wow. This is where we made a huge mess. Didn't we? Alright, well, let's light this up. I don't see any more. Oh, gosh! Okay, well, this, this shouldn't be a problem. Oh. Yeah, these uh, webs are gonna come in handy here to keep these guys off of our tail. Off of our six. And I'm gonna just load up on them. I'm not worried about how I get out of here. We'll just jump over it, I guess. Maybe we'll put... Uh, yeah, we can do something like this. All right, so I can get up and out. No, you! Oh, you ding-dong. Yeah, that works too, whatever. I'm trying to get super fancy here, but I shouldn't. So, there's a spawner right there. Um, here, let's light this up first. Because I'm wondering if they're spawning up here from... That spawner down there. Can they get up here? I don't think so. <laughs> I mean, I could just get inside and grab the thing and go, I guess, right? <laughs> I 
I mean, why not? That's fair. I'm doing it. Goodbye. Enough of this mess. Yeah, we're done here. We're done here. I was trying to get fancy. But we don't need to be fancy. We just need to we just need to be survivors. Oh, they're falling off right here. Oh, I wonder if they're spawning over there. Oh. And then they're dropping down. There might be another spawner hidden in that wall there. Yeah, oh Vex, you little tricksy guy. Little tricksy guy, you. Um. Alright, we're gonna have to cut through here. Hate to use that by a sword, but it has mending. So we're good. Alright. Now we just have to find our way out. Um, there's a stair right there. Let's go. Oh, gosh, we got a super fast guy here. We got what we came for. And now we just have to skedaddle. Get back to the beginning. Oh my gosh. Now we're on the same level as them. And here they come. Yep. That's some serious pathfinding and memory for these guys, huh? We could just drop down, right? How far is that water? Oh! We should do that. We should do that. <laughs> Just do a Geronimo. Just don't want to die. It's probably the best way. Geronimo! Oh, what if we hit ice? That could be a problem. Oh, okay, we're good. <laughs> it didn't look like ice. Unfortunately, there's nothing in the water that can kill us. Yay! We have escaped the biggest dingus mine, and we have the box of parts. Now all we have to do is swim out of here. And I'm pretty sure... This way leads out. All right, guys, we're back at base at the airship platform. It's a lovely evening. It's snowing again, but uh, that's not going to stop us from pressing the button and applying our box of parts to the airship. Now, is it? No, it shan't. Let's bring up the HUD so we can see this. And voila! Four boxes of parts. You need a total of eight. Okay, it's looking good. Looking real good, but I can't get in there. To look up close, unfortunately. But yeah, it's taking shape. It's halfway done. So we got four more boxes of parts to find. And we shall continue in the next episode. Although, we have to find the next intersection, don't we? Because we, we have completed the biggest, diggest mine. And that was the last section at that... Um, at the uh, second intersection. So, and you know what? I think we're out of diaries, too. I think there's like one book left. So I'm not sure... If Talia just uh, didn't visit all the places or what. Maybe we have to find another base um, in a, at the third section. Uh, intersection. I don't know. Anywho. I am done here. I can barely talk anymore. My throat is raw from uh, from this cold. But, but I'm going to eat some bread. Anywho. And with that, my friends, I'm going to call it quits. Hope you enjoyed. And we'll see you next time. Have a good day. Bye-bye.